Okay, 16, 19, good luck. So we've not played before, we have no head-to-head -head score there. 875 games we've played. Actually, very similar to what I've done. What am I on? 760, so we're not far off. We're just going to challenge for the center and try and get castle. I think I'll stick to a Reti principle and put the bishop on the diagonal. Okay, no need to play too quickly. It is 10 minutes. Knight comes forward. What's he trying to do? Hmm, I don't know. I'm going to challenge for the center. It does weaken the pawn, so I might spend a move guarding. Um, do I want to do that? He threatens to take, take, maybe come here, but we do hit the knight. Oh, he's offering a draw. I shouldn't offer a draw, really, there. Let's just develop the knight. He takes. Just try and play and win the game. You might actually win it. You might do really well. Let's play across and hit the pawn. Okay, he hits the rook. So we can take. If he attacks the rook, I can definitely drop back. So I can come all the way back to the dark square if needed. Or here I can trade. Queen up is a move. Knight up might become a move. Okay, so I've got queen up to hit the knight. Queen up. I mean, I could, no, maybe that's not quite right. Let's just play queen up and hit the knight. He'll probably have to block, which he does. So I'm going to play bishop up and threaten to capture another pawn. We'll hit the queen and the knight if he allows it. Maybe spend another move with bishop. Knight in, he can actually take and he covers the queen. So knight in would be a blunder there. Oh, he's played rook across. Okay. So I think I just take and it should just win the game on the spot, I think. Well, opponent's left the game. Okay, I'll, I'll show the dot because I'm, I'm keeping that hidden. Oh, my opponent's disconnected and reconnected. That's exactly why I'm not showing that dot anymore. Opponent is disconnected and reconnected. So this could be a suspicious one here. It could be. Mm, okay, I'll show that for the rest of the game, but... We know the internet connection is good, so I don't need to check it if the dot goes off, but I'll just get the queen off the board. Yeah, but all I do there is I'm checking that they've got a very good internet connection, so if they leave the game, it's a deliberate action. The game's just about over, though, isn't it? Check, you'll have to block. Bishop up, up, everything can trade off. I've still got to pay attention, though, if I'm getting a queen. Hmm, so I want to still pay attention. Let's check. You'll have to block. Yeah, but that's why I'm just hiding this dot now, so it doesn't bug me when players leave the game. But I'll just um, do that again. So I've got bishop up, king up. Takes, 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 king takes. One of these pawns is actually going to be lost, so it's not a complete formality. I actually like the idea of knight up. Or is it though? Is it good? Yeah. Knight up threatens to come across, threatens a check, maybe he just has to castle. That's what he's done. I'm going to just take the pawn. I'll trade the rook as soon as he moves. Mm, actually, I will show that dot again for the rest of the game. Yeah, pawn has left the game again. He's disconnecting and reconnecting, isn't he? He's still on the site, you see. He's leaving the game, but he's still on the side. He's got an excellent connection. And now he's rejoined the game, and now he's leaving again. He's doing this deliberately, so this is something suspicious here. Mm. Okay, I'll leave it on for the rest of that game. Yeah, he's doing it a lot. Actually, no, I will hide it. He's doing it a lot. Hmm. Yeah, I don't need to see that again. The site can actually track all that. He might not be aware of it, but the site can actually track this. I'll just take the rook. He's left the game again, but the site get a recording every time somebody does this. Actually, no, the game's so won now. I can afford to show this, can't I? So we've lost one. The game should be completely won here, but I, I think something's going on. I suspect something's going on, but we might be wrong. But that's why I'm just hiding that little dot now, so it doesn't bother me while I actually play the games. But yeah, the site will, will be aware. 
every time that happens they get a little time stamp on it so they know that it's actually going on i just have to kind of like i say pay attention so we don't blunder the whole game away just in case something is going on like this here yeah, he's left the game and rejoined again so let's just push forward yeah he's doing it every move isn't he he's doing it every move but i think i'm comfortable enough this game that i'll still play this one out normally i'll just completely stop and not play the game yeah he's just leaving the game every move hmm. Yeah, most of my games now you won't actually see this i'm just using a little bit of code that the um leeches have kindly provided so you don't get bothered by this nonsense and there he goes offering a draw again hmm. oh what to do what to do i'm just going to get the game over with and then obviously i'll be reporting this and blocking the account after the game Okay, comes over. I can quite happily let him take there. It's going to be cleanly winning, but there's no need to give away free pieces or so. Let's just come here for now. And I'll just come up. I said, we've got so much material, it's not too bad there, is it? Yeah, but there's something going on with that one. I think I suspect so anyway. You can just see from that there. So, But that's why I'm keeping that hidden now, so that doesn't bother me when it's happening. So we'll pause and put it through the engine, but... It's up to Leeches to determine fair play. It's played on their site, so they determine the fair play issues. Let's just see what it was in engine speak. Well, so I've managed to play a pretty decent game considering there. So 93% versus 84 accuracy, CPL 30 and 59. That's in line with my average. It's just slightly over 30, I think, like 31 or 32, something like that. So I managed to play a pretty decent game there, but I say it looks a bit suspicious from our opponent's behaviour. There might be an explanation for it. It's up to Lee Chester to determine that. It's not up to me to determine that. That's entirely up to Lee Chester to worry about. It's their site, it's their platform, so they're obviously determine fair play issues as they see fit and in this position like i say i've got so much material i thought i'll just play the game and i'll play it out normally if i see that behavior i would just stop playing and not play the game so it is what it is and then the game ends there so it is what it is